Hi this is Muhammad Rafiq welcome to my tech channel if you new here make sure click that subscribe button and enable bell icon for getting notifications for my future video uploads In this video I will show you how to fix the printer issue which is while you try to access or install network or shared printer and the error will show up like this which is operation failed with error code ending with 011b Here I just want to install the network printer on my computer and you can see the error came up with uh, windows cannot connect to the printer and if you click the see details you can see operation failed with error code ending with 011b so let us go and see how to fix this printer issue this printer issue mainly will appear after one of the windows security update was happened on your windows 10 pc i will show you which update is causing this printer issue for that just click start menu and click settings just click update and security here just click view update history and here you can see one of the windows update named kb500670 actually this update is making this printer issue so if you uninstall this update from your system the printer issue will be solved i have posted on video previously how to remove this update Just watch that video then you can understand how to uninstall it from your system you can see the link on the video description but actually this is not a permanent solution why if this update will happen again the printer issue will be show up again So let us see how to solve this issue permanently. For that you have to watch this video completely. So let us start the video how to fix this issue permanently. For that just click start menu and here search for printer. Then click on printers and scanners. it will open printers and scanners window just click on add a printer or a scanner and it's uh, searching and here just click on the printer that i want isn't listed just click on it and it will open add printer window here just click add a local printer or network printer with uh, manual settings just click uh, next here just click create new port and select standard tcp ip port click next and here enter the host name or ip address i just enter the network ip address click next and now the windows is uh, try to detecting the port if it is detected you can just select and uh, install and uh, 
and you can see this uh, need additional port information required so i just choose custom and click uh, settings and here just uh, select uh, lpr under protocol and under lpr settings just uh, enter the queue name something and uh, select uh, lpr byte counting enabled click ok click next and the windows is again communicating with the printer and if it is automatically detected then uh, it will install And you can see it's still not detected the printer name is uh, developed so I just uh, click have disk and click browse I saved the driver on my computer so choose the location click, uh, this is the driver I saved on my computer just uh, select the driver click open click ok click next just choose use the driver currently installed click next enter the printer name anything you will like click next the printer is installing And the printer is installed just click on do not share this printer click next and click finish you can make it default click finish that's it and you can see the printer is installed on the computer that's it thanks for watching the video don't forget to subscribe my channel and if this video was helpful for you please like the video and if you have any queries or any questions please comment below the video i will look into it